Hello everybody, welcome to Two Minutes with PJ. Today's date, March 29th, 2016. Our discussion today is going to be on harmony. In Romans 8.27, And the Father who knows all hearts knows, of course, that the Spirit is saying as He pleads for us in harmony with God's own will. Romans 15.5 May God, who gives patience, steadiness, and encouragement, help you to live in complete harmony with each other, each with the attitude of Christ toward the other. 1 Corinthians 1.10 But, dear brothers, I beg you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ to stop arguing among yourselves. Let there be real harmony so that there won't be splits in the church. I plead with you to be of one mind, united in thought and purpose. 2 Corinthians 6.15 And what harmony can there be between Christ and the devil? How can a Christian be a partner with one who doesn't believe? 2 Corinthians 13.11 I close my letter with these last words. Be happy, grow in Christ. Pay attention to what I have said. Live in harmony and peace. And may the God of love and peace be with you. Colossians 3.14 Most of all, let love guide your life, for then the whole church will stay together in perfect harmony. God knows those in harmony with His will. He is patient, steadiness, and encourages us to live in complete harmony with Him and each other. We need to stop our arguing among ourselves in the name of Jesus and reunite in one mind, thought, and purpose. Through Jesus Christ we can live in harmony and peace. God's love will be with us. The church needs to stay together in harmony. I want you to think about harmony this day and try and not argue with anybody and have good harmony and great harmony with everybody today. God bless and have a blessed day.